Hello guys, so today I'm going to show you how you can jailbreak your iOS device with the latest iOS version. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys right here. I have the latest iOS version, which is 12.4.1, and I'm going to show you guys how you can jailbreak your device no matter what iOS version you have. As long as it's not too early, um, like before iOS 9, I believe, you should be good. But ultimately, it works for the latest one. So you want to go on jailbreaktoday.com. Here's the URL. The link will also be at the bottom left-hand corner of the screen. Anyways, once you get to this website, all you have to do is go ahead and uh, scroll to the top and hit verify compatibility. And then once you hit that, you want to select your Apple device. So you have a lot of options to choose from. I have an iPhone X, so I'm going to go ahead and choose that. And then iOS version, I have the latest stable version, which is 12.4.1, and then hit verify compatibility. Now, once you do that, just going to go ahead and process your request and verify that you're compatible for a jailbreak, which if you're like me and you have the latest iOS version 12.4.1, you will be compatible. So what you want to do now is just hit the blue jailbreak button to get started. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and click this button right over here. And once I press this button, you guys will see here, it's going to go ahead and start the jailbreak process. So what it's doing here is downloading the jailbreak files and extracting them onto your device. This includes files like Cydia. But before you can get these jailbreak onto your device, you're going to have to do human verification. So just hit the human verification button. The reason there's human verification is just to verify you're not a bot DDoSing or overloading the servers. Anyways, once you hit that button, it's going to show you a list of apps. All you have to do is download and run two apps from this list and follow the instructions below each app you install. So we're going to go ahead and install two apps. Here's the first one. I'm going to hit tap to install. It's going to go ahead and redirect me to the app store. And once it does that, I can start installing this first app. All right. So I'm going to start installing this app and then I'll go back onto the list of apps and choose the second app. And the second app right here, I'm going to click it. It's going to redirect me to the app store. And once it does that, I can start installing the second app as well. And I'll just now wait for the installation of both of these apps to complete so I can begin the human verification process. All right, so it's a very, very fast download since these apps are very small in size. And you guys can see here, just like that, it's done installing. I can then begin with this first app. So you wanna make sure you carefully read the instructions below each app you install because the instructions for this app told me I just need to sign up for free. So I'm just gonna go ahead, hit sign up for free, and we're just gonna quickly register for an account. Also, it's important to note in general, you want to make sure you're on each app for at least 30 seconds, like I said earlier. So I'm going to complete these instructions by signing up for an account, and then I'll spend a few more seconds on this app to make sure I've been on it for at least 30 seconds. All right, so successfully registered for my account, and now I'm just going to go ahead and spend a few more seconds on this app just to make sure I've been on the app for at least 30 seconds. So I'm going to go ahead and just do some human interactions and just scroll through this app just so I can get that 30 seconds. Um, so now I'm just going to go ahead and go on to the next app since I've completed the first app. And for this app, the instructions had nothing specific. All I needed to do is make sure I'm on the app for at least 30 seconds. So I'm going to go ahead and just get on this app and then spend 30 seconds on it. Or I should say at least 30 seconds. I usually go a little over 30 seconds just to be safe. Anyways, during the 30 seconds, you want to make sure you're doing interactions on the app to make sure you've been on the app for at least 30 seconds. So what I'm going to do here is just scroll through the app and make sure I'm doing human interactions because you want to make sure you're not idle on the app. Anyways, once you're done with that app, you guys will now just need to power off your device and power it back on. So essentially just restart your device and when you open it back up, when you've turned it on, the files like Cydia have been extracted onto your device and you've now successfully jailbroken your device. That simple guys. Um, make sure you follow all the instructions of this video and go on jailbreaktoday.com to do this for your own device. You guys can see here I'm on Cydia. If you don't know what Cydia is, Cydia is basically the hub where you're able to get all of these modded and hacked apps uh, like watching free movies, streaming free t TV shows, unlimited Spotify premium, really cool stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and have a good one.